We have brought 23 bison from South Dakota to the Kanki Sands Preserve here in Indiana. We wanted to bring bison to the site for the grazing impacts that they would have on the prairie. The prairie here in Indiana is dominated by very tall stature grasses. What we wanted to do is increase the, the, the breadth of stature that we have so there's more mid grass, more short grass, so that we can appeal to a broader range of species. Bison are very selective in their diets. They focus in on grasses, sedges, and brushes. Uh, they tend to leave the forbs, the wildflowers alone. And so what you have are 23 individuals that are out there selectively grazing all the time uh, and influencing the prairie as a result. Bison were extirpated from the state around the 1830s. We naturally look to historical records to see if bison existed in this area of Indiana previously. We found several records, including one that's about 10 miles north of our current location. The picture that we get is that instead of the very large migratory herds that you would have found west of the Mississippi, uh, herds this far east would have been much smaller. They would have been much more tribal. They would have tended to have a home range and stick within that home range. We ask that people do not stop on the roads uh, while viewing bison. Uh, we've set up a dedicated visitor area. There is a large parking lot and there are several trails that bring you up to the hilltops uh, to be able to get a good view of the prairie and bison.